Good morning. I hope you're all doing well. I've just sat down for breakfast. I've got like muesli and cornflakes and nuts and berries and yogurt and stuff. And then some rubosh tea, which would be very nice. It's really lovely and sunny, so I get to sit outside, which is really a lovely. Look, it's lovely, lovely view. And then they've just got like a sofa outside. We're going to meet some more of their friends today. But see you later. So we've just stopped for ice cream, and I want to show you the fact that they have Smurf ice cream. <laughs> Look. It's like bright blue. It's called Smurfy. They also have marshmallows. It's well. Yeah, there is. Crazy. So we've all got our ice creams now, and I've got strawberry sorbet. Woo! <laughs> Everyone says hello. And you can see it's a beautiful lake, and we're going to go up a sightseeing tower next, which is called Empress Tower. So we've come to the little tower, and I'm about to climb up. It's a very typical finish. Lots and lots of wood. <laughs> So we've got to the top of the tower now, climbed all 66 steps, um, and it's very typical Finland. Lots and lots of pretty links. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> you scared of heights? Yes, yes I am. Oh. <laughs> so we've now come to an ostrich farm, as my host Al wants to get some ostrich meat. Yay. <laughs> so I thought I'd show you the actual ostriches. It's feeding time at the moment, apparently. There are lots of other animals here as well, but less exciting. Oh, hello. <laughs> Baby ostriches. <laughs> hello, so I thought I'd give you a little like summary of the evening because I haven't filmed it very well. Basically, their like, close neighbours, family, friends came round. Um, Otil, Oti, I think she's called. Um, and Suma and we had a kind of barbecue type thing we made kebabs with for me and Martha we had tofu and lots and lots of vegetables and then they had meat and stuff as well and oh they were so good they were really really nice and then we played a Finnish game called Muka Muka Muki Muki Muku Muku some one of those is hopefully right where you basically throw this like batten thing at different it's kind of similar to bowling kind of complicated but yeah um, that was really fun and then we came back in and had chocolate covered strawberries insert a little video uh, chocolate covered strawberry <laughs> time <laughs> oh sambo can't reach Don't remember the <laughs> and there's also vegan chocolate as well which is great mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and then me and martha made hummus insert other video so me and Martha just made hummus, but I put far too much paprika in, so it's now like really spicy and really garlicky, but I don't mind, but I'm going to have horrible smelling breath, <laughs> so everyone's trying that now. And we're playing something that's a bit like Pictionary, and a bit like Fortunes, where you like turn the paper over, but <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. So you had to write first an adjective, then you turn it over and pass it around, then a noun, then you turn that over and pass it around. And then the next person opens it up and draws it, draws the adjective and the noun. Hang on. Sorry, Odie and Sumo were just leaving, so I had to go and say goodbye. Oh, I wanted to go and say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. I can't talk properly in English anymore, it's really bad. Um, anyway, so then once you've drawn the adjective and the noun, you pass it around, but fold it over. And then the next person have to write, has to write what they think you've drawn. And then they fold your drawing over and then the next person draws what they've written and so on and so on. And so you end up with these little stories and it's like Chinese whispers how the original words transform through these drawings. And Oh my god, it was so funny. Genuinely, it was the most hilarious thing. So, and now other people are going in the sauna and I've just come out to do some like songwriting the ukulele stuff. So... Cause it's so pretty. I'm on the little like PC. I don't know what they keep asking me what the word for this is. And according to the dictionary, it's a peer. I don't think this is a peer because it's very small. But I don't know if we have a word for this in English. If you think there is a word for one of these in English, please write it below because I don't have a clue. Um, yeah. So I think I'll end my vlog here, and I will speak to you again soon. <laughs> Bye, guys.